Chris 6 weather forecast. Hey there, so we're getting a little bit closer to having more fall like weather. It's still a bit of a couple weeks away here, but we're getting there bit by bit in terms of us having some rain coming into the forecast uh, in, uh, in just a few hours here and definitely by tomorrow into the weekend as well. And we'll see a small dip in our temperatures associated with that cold front bringing us those rain showers as well. But here's what you need to know before you head outside for today. Uh, we're going to have an increase in our rain chances for today, and some of those spotty showers are going to be on their way in our area as we look ahead to around 10. 11 a.m. this morning, but they will be spotty showers. So not everyone will see them. Will be the first couple uh, bits, maybe like an appetizer before the main course of the uh, showers will be making their way into our area here. But it has to do with our cold front though, that we're expecting to eventually start pushing through into our area for today because it will have a big impact depending on where exactly the cold front uh, will push in and exactly when as well. So right now it is kind of stalling a little bit in uh, uh, central Texas right now, but eventually it will start to push its way down further south to us, giving us the opportunity, of course, to see those rain showers ahead. But also associated with that cold front it's finally going to be pushing through our area. It's also going to lower our temperatures just a bit so it won't be feeling as hot out there. But as a result of the increase of moisture in our area, we are going to have a little bit more humid conditions for this afternoon and we'll have heat alerts in effect for today as well. But I'll get into that in just a second here. Right now, let's look at our current conditions all across the area. Right now, Corpus Christi is sitting at 79 degrees, but feels like 83. In Kingsville, you guys are also sitting at 79 degrees with your feel like temperature at 83 degrees as well for this morning. But as I said, with that extra moisture and humidity in our atmosphere, we're going to have some heat advisors in place for today for three counties here. We're going to have uh, San Patricio, New West as well as Claiborne counties here under a heat advisory for today. It will begin at 1 p.m. and we'll continue all the way until 6 p.m. when it does eventually expire then. So this is a quick reminder though, with the heat alert being in place, that does mean we'll be dealing with more intense and dangerous heat. So it will be feel like temperatures ranging from 110 all the way up to 114 degrees for this afternoon. So make sure you're being careful out there. If those are folks who have cute little puppies like who we're featuring today, Frodo, uh, looking all excited maybe for her walk later on for today there. But as a result of those heat advisories in place, you may want to get your uh, dog walks done earlier this morning. And as we look at our air temperatures here, it's should be pretty good as we go throughout the rest of this morning until, of course, by the time we get to around 11 a.m., we'll start to see our temperatures start to grow just a little bit, getting to around the upper 90s, making it a bit more uncomfortable. But as I said, with that cold front, we'll eventually start to push its way through our area here by the time we get into the weekend, and it will bring us those showers that we're expecting, especially those thunderstorms as well, and those, those heavier periods of rain that we're looking forward to, giving us hopefully a little bit of help with those drought-like conditions that we're still dealing with here in the coastal bend. So for today, we are looking at a high of 97 degrees with a couple spotty showers with more showers to come as we look ahead into early Friday morning into the weekend.